you guys are going to buy an alien gear, you should go out to your store and get some Loctite and take your Smith, well your uh, whatever gun you have, holster you have, take it apart, put Loctite on the nuts because I was out and about and was at the gun store. I uh, pulled my holster out to show my friend and I lost the front and bottom screws before I left my house and I got there and I pulled it out didn't realize it that they're gone you know so I called some, called up uh, alien gear and they said the suggestion is to get locked tight well then I didn't end up coming home and I found or my mom found these and the screws on the floor downstairs when I was going outside and I called Ellen gear up and I told him what was going on and wasn't too happy so Ellen gear is sending me another holster in the mail and I might as well keep this one because the 3.5 tuck and the cloak tuck in your car this is a cloak tuck in the car I bought another one of these for my house I was gonna give it to my brother but decided to keep it and about the 3.5 tuck that is it's a pain in the ass to uh, keep taking this out of your where you have in your pants and put it in your car and put it back in your back of your pocket area or back of your waist wherever you have it every time you want to get out of your car the 4.0 one there's an attachment that goes on here and you just pull it off and put it in your car mount. So it's only a disappointment about the 3.5 Helen gear tuck, cloak tuck. So I'm going to put some Loctite on here and hopefully it doesn't fall apart on me again. Uh, so yeah, Helen gear is 100% the product anything happens to it they usually replace it and well fortunately uh, then no they said the factory must have did something they want to send it back and see the view and see what's going on and I don't really want to send it back when you have to take it out of your back of your waist and put it in your car and then put it back in so they're sending me a new one and I'm going to just keep this one in my car and so when I get my car to go drive in, I could just pull my gun out, put it in here, or have it melted onto my car on the side. So yeah, I'm going to put some Loctite on here, and hope you guys like this video, and subscribe if you want. All right, I'm going to pause it, and I'm going to come back, show you the Loctite it's on. Well, see, I put Loctite on it so I'm gonna make sure it doesn't come apart this time so focus there we go I'm gonna do that to all four of them I'm gonna screw it in the top one working on my second one I got my Smith & Wesson 2.0 compact Pretty nice gun. I got my Smith & Weston knife. Yeah. I got my core in my bag. I'll show you all my guns when I get done. Alright, I got them. I'm going to screw in the last one. That should be the last one. I'm going to put my gun in there to let you, let you know. The gun is clear. No bullet. No magazine. We're being safe. We're gonna put in the holster, left-handed holster, alien gear. And put it in here so I can get the tightness of it. Alright. Alright, pause it again. Alright. That's my compact 2.0 Smith & Weston Alien Gear holster. It is on there tight and it's not coming out this time. Last time I just got it right out of the package and just put it in my back. 
and I was like, oh, a couple, three, four days later, I'm like, oh, okay. And I put it on, didn't even notice it. The screws were off and left the house and went to the gun store and take it out and it was all apart. I wasn't too happy about that, so yeah. And that's my core 940 mil that I picked up at Outdoor Jacks. With my red dot optic that I just got. It's about a, almost a thousand dollar, almost close to a thousand dollars they charged me. Like two thirty for the optic and seven hundred and something for the gun, the tax. And I got my twenty two compact. I got a muzzle brake on it. So showing off my compacts I got. I haven't shot the forty yet. I'm supposed to go out today, but things came up. So, yeah, my defense bullets, and I got extra clips with the alien gear, and I got the cloak dock in my car mounted already. I'm going to mount this one on my desk by my bed. So, hope you liked this video. Subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Alright, bye.